Welcome to One Word a Day. I'm Sophie, your pilot into the universe of Chinese. Let's continue our May special edition of、uh, Chinese translations of brand names. Today we're going to talk about Sony. Sony actually is not from the West; it's from East Asia. <laughs> it's Sony. So Sony. I guess it's an effort for the Japanese brand to be easily recognizable. So it's, I guess, the early days of a branding.、Um, you know, when more and more consumer brands show up on the market, they have to differentiate themselves. So Sony, I don't know the full story of the origin why they name themselves as Sony, but Sony, when it came to China, for Chinese to be able to pronounce it,、um, because Sony just by the English、uh, look. Uh, regular Chinese without the English training wouldn't be able to pronounce.、Um, but when we translate it, we this was based on phonetic only, and you can see "so" that's "so" and "ni," just like "ny," right? "So ni"、uh, by the character meaning "so" means cable, and has nothing to do with with this electronic brand. And ni means intimate. Okay, I just learned ni means intimate by doing this because just by looking at the the breakdown of characters, which is the two of them, it actually doesn't mean intimate to me. But according to scholars, it means intimate. Okay, let me tell me my vision here. This almost like a big distorted question mark thing. Look, that means dead body. This big bulge is. The head of the dead animal, most likely, and then the rest of the body is flat, lifeless. So it's a body, and then the right side is a person symbol flipped around. So this person, when it's flipped, that implies change. That implies that person is no longer is it already,、um, I mean, original form. So it, when it's next to a dead body, you can. Almost imagine that means somebody transition from being the living thing to dead thing, right? Because it's it's changed. It's no longer its original self, and we have the dead body there. It's almost like somebody passed away, and then you have your spirit departing from the. I mean, we can imagine all kind of scenarios, but this intimate probably can also explain by okay, these are two bodies. And they are having an intimate moment simply by the proximity, like how the two, one is a flipped about a person, one is, you know, like a body of that person, immobile and not moving. I don't know. I think both are possible. It could be over、uh, the evolution of character, things got changed. So. Take as you wish,、uh, but I think instead of like a dead body that's too heavy and scary, intimate probably is the better better translation. Cable simply is a visual representation of you see these knots; those are the、um, the depicting how cable would look like. And the two sides, I'm not sure the wrapper doesn't mean emphasizing the look, the exterior look of the cable. But in any case, sua means. Thicker chain type of cable.、Um, okay, so Sony phonetic translation for Chinese two character combined together doesn't make any sense. So not relevant to the brand, not semantically meaningful for us. So that's Sony. All right, thank you for your time. See you another day.